Good afternoon, everybody. I hope everybody are well. Today I'm back with a new video about one of the most rare cactus that is known as Tephro cactus geometricus. This particular variety of the cactus is native to two different area which is Argentina and Bolivia. In its natural environment, it grows in a desert, sunny and hot area. But the soil in that region is very well drained soil which it will help this plant to grow better. Tephro cactus has quite several different variety. Another variety of it is this particular one that is a little bit shape of a pine cone and commonly known as a pine cone cactus, which is called Tephro cactus articulatus. But our subject today is about this one, Geometricus. Geometricus is one of the very extremely rare and pricey cactus that they grow on the top of each other, as you see right here, the pops grows on the top and they create level by level different type of growth. The color of this particular cactus, because it loves a lot of sun and heat, sometime in that environment become more purplish reddish color. It has a very pretty flower, which is pinkish, but the flower only lasts about one day. The body of this plant is globular and round with the segments that are stuck on the top of each other like a, a snowman and has a very beautiful textures as you see that create a very beautiful shape. Tephro cactus geometrix or geometricus is not a very common cactus. As I have said to begin with, it is among the rare and hard to find type of cactus and pricey. Here you see most of these young ones do not have any needle, but this one does provide some needles that generally happens when the plant gets older and older. That doesn't mean that these ones are young. No, these are also older plants but it's a cutting because growing this particular cactus from seeds truly is not easy and extremely is a challenging. So the best bet is to just cut pieces and propagate it. But also there is an issue about it that when the plant start growing this shape, start picking the very good value so therefore sometimes you do not want to separate 
because it takes a long, long time to stack on the top of each other. So the solution is this, that you have a few of these plants and keep some of them for the shows, as you see. And some of them only for propagation. Here I have this one, this one, this one, and this one, and this one. And uh, these are the ones that I don't intend to separate, but I have some other ones in the greenhouse that they are generally is good for separation. As you see, the needle of this plant is very nice and they are laying down and also white color. But in this particular variety, Articulatus, they have a sort of needle that become like a very much white and like a sheet, like a, a leaf. Tephro cactus is among the very, very slow growing cactus. And uh, it is very easy to propagate if you do by the cutting separation. Uh, every segment of this cactus is approximately four to five centimeter. Sometimes you see this plant in a very nice green as you see on the screen, the big one. And sometimes you see it more purplish color. That is, depends on the heat and sun that the plant is placed. There are not very visible leaves on this cactus, but they are very, very tiny. When they are small, when they start popping up, you see the fuzzy spots on the top of the pop, which is fading away throughout the time as the plant is growing and getting tall. Here you see it, but on the mother plant, which is right here, there is none. Those white spots is fading away. I would like to encourage you to reach to find some of these cactus and uh, add it to your collection and grow it because they are very easy going, as I have said, very easy to grow. But uh, as they grow and become more uh, stack on the top of each other and become more uh, older, they are not really cheap to purchase. I can simply tell you that if there is a piece that there is four or five pieces growing on the top of the plant, it may not be able to be purchased less than a 200 to 300 US dollars. However, I hope you enjoyed this video. This is a video that I wanted to add to my uh, videos for you to enjoy. If you do so, enjoy it. Like my video, leave me a comment if you have a question, recommend to your friends and relatives. 
I look forward to present to you another video very soon. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. It will help me to produce more video. I need more of you to watch my channel and learn about this variety of a cactus and succulent collection. Thank you. Until next time.